So, I don't know, this has been a really annoying problem. So, we have a Tessie satellite C55B299 Intel inside. So, basically, a trashy processor. It's like a notebook. So, every time I try to install Windows because it's been wiped, I'm trying to install Windows 10 on it. It initially comes with Windows 8. Every, like, after I try to. One time I shut it down, accidental before shut it down because it was like crashing or whatever. And every time I try to boot it up, it keeps loading and stopping. So every time I try to install Windows, either it stops at 60% or 40% and doesn't move. And I have to keep on wiping the hard drive and that process before it gets to start up. And then if it do get to start up and Windows installs and you turn off your laptop, which I turn on again, it's it just the circle stops loading and it just freezes. I don't know what to do. Try to press everything, then it waits it through or nothing. If y'all have a fix for this, I don't know if anybody else experiences this problem. I know because it's really freaking annoying ass problem. So yeah.